a missing man, a burned car, and a skull in the trunk. Are you ready to get your parade on? Well, we are here at Action News. It's the Umatilla Landing Days. The partying is probably still going on in Miami as we speak. The Miami Heat are back-to-back -back world champions. We do have some good news for you this morning. Columbia Basin College is getting a lot of money to actually save some money. You were telling me about that earlier, and I was saying it reminds me of that movie Aliens, where the alien acid sizzles. Since it's now legal to smoke marijuana here in Washington, drug recognition experts in Franklin County. Now we're cruising above Riverton. The temperature is about 50 degrees in the air. And oil and fuel are spilling into the river. The Franklin County Sheriff's Department says Klontz is healthy with no injuries. Staying on the movie front this morning, going from zombies to the newsroom. At this hour in the morning, I often feel like a zombie myself, but the long anticipated Anchorman 2 is coming out. Lawnmower guru himself, Jay Frank, is at the Weather Center. Jay is the only guy I know that looks forward to doing his lawn every year. Jay, why is that? City leaders are asking you to help them pick a new city manager. Extra special guest this morning. Uh, no doubt he looks familiar. This is Cookie Monster, obviously. How's it going, Cookie? Turns out our own state is the least foul-mouthed in the entire U.S., so we had to talk to you about it and find out what you think. The price at the pump continues to go down across the country, and it's the same kind of trend here locally as well. Welcome back to Action News this morning. I am live here in our Pasco studios with Carolyn Friday. She is with the Relay for Life. Most of us can think of a million things we'd rather do than mow the lawn. Speaking for myself right now because Jay enjoys it very much. Yeah, I enjoy it, but uh, you couldn't do it if somebody paid you, Lindsay, huh? I don't, think, I don't think you could pay me enough money to do that. I don't even know where to start, so it would be a disaster waiting to happen. The only time I actually did attempt to mow a lawn, yeah. Jay, um, my dad had a tractor. What are those? four-wheeler lawn mowers. Sure. Yeah, I got on top of it and it wouldn't break. So uh, <laughs> I was traumatized after that. How'd you get off it? I don't remember. It was so traumatizing. Did you jump off and just send it I into think, the hedge? I think I jumped off and rolled a bunch of times and uh, it was kind of like an army move a right there. Roll. Lindsay, how you feeling? I'm feeling okay. I have to go to the dentist today. Do so uh, yeah, I, I can already tell I have tons of cavities. Um, I have a bad sweet tooth. Jay, I remember when I first moved here, you helped me with about 20 boxes. I that did, I remember that. Yeah, so you are a great mover yourself. Are your services available? <laughs> Not for hire. Not for hire. I wanted to tell you about my own dog and how he keeps cool during the summer, but he doesn't live here, so I didn't think Jay would let me 